Hey, that's me. I've never liked reading. It's never something I choose to do. Film over book any day. The closest I'd get to reading was from the subtitles on Netflix. But there was a time I would open a book. At school we would study Jekyll and Hyde, and I'd read other books like To Kill a Mockingbird. We'd read these during class and even as homework. But it's one thing to do something for pleasure, one thing to be forced to. And if I'm being honest, half of the time I would just use book summaries online to pass as my homework. But can you really blame me? Schools don't exactly endorse the most thrilling books, and we live in times where our entertainment options are spoiled for choice. Video games, social media, films, even porn. Why are you looking at me like that? Why read when we can get instant gratification and a quick source of dopamine? I agree. It was only in the start of my gap year where I had the thought and intention I should start reading. I wanted to undergo self-development, and where better to start than a bit of reading? I set out to make this a reality. I went to uncharted territory and found a few books that caught my eye. It was thrilling. I had these brand new shiny pieces of eye candy. I felt like a booktuber, an academic, a bookworm, a librarian, a uh, Jack Edwards. Until I refound these books a few months later, accompanied by dust. You see, I forgot all about the books. I missed the accountability to pick them up. But I stumbled upon this TED talk. And I remain a guy who possesses no special gift of talent or skill. All I do is take really big, ambitious projects that people seem to marvel at, break them down to their simplest form, and then just make marginal improvements along the way to improve my odds of achieving them. 10 pages a day, the compound effect. Little actions compound over time. 10 pages a day and you can finish a book in a month. 10 pages a day, that's all I need. I felt empowered. I felt relieved. Oof. I felt myself getting lost inside a book. Wow, I was reading and I was enjoying it. I was reading fiction, then non-fiction. And I felt like I had turned from Jekyll to Hyde and reading had become my animalistic no. desire. Some days I read more than 10 pages, some days just 10, but I was reaching the end of books and it was satisfying. Woo! If I can do it, you can. I promise you there is a book out there that you will like. It's just waiting for you. 10 pages a day. Take a leaf out of my book.